In response to the crime, Mayor Linda Gordon has asked the city's internal audit department to take a look at its wire transfer process to see if it can be tightened up. She's added that she is grateful to have the FBI and Secret Service involved in the investigation. Well, now to an LEX 18 investigates follow up on a local Commonwealth's attorney who allegedly offered favors to a defendant for nude pictures of her. Evening Edition's Lee Searcy reports on the action his fellow prosecutors across the state took against him. Local Commonwealth's attorney Ronnie Goldie is still on the job prosecuting cases in Bath, Montgomery, Menifee, and Rowan counties. But you won't find him here. On the members page of the Kentucky Commonwealth's Attorneys Association, the 21st Circuit, where he works, is removed from the list after fellow top prosecutors voted to expel Goldie over alleged misconduct in office. His removal tied to these 230 pages of Facebook messages in question between him and a criminal defendant who Goldie allegedly gave gas money to and helped in court cases in exchange for nude pictures of her. One from June of 2018 indicates the two messaged about warrants she had. Goldie reportedly saying, you owe me big time. The judge is about to withdraw some warrants. We asked him about the messages last month. Again, any comment that I have will be saved for the appropriate time, the appropriate forum, the appropriate people. The Kentucky Supreme Court has been asked to temporarily suspend Goldie from practicing law, but no action has been taken. The prosecutors group also voted to remove Christian County Commonwealth's attorney Rick Bowling, who's tied to a controversial pardon of a convicted rapist by former Governor Matt Bevin. The association can't formally discipline, suspend, or remove elected Commonwealth's attorneys from office, but it can prevent them from going to group functions and conferences. The association's president writing, information has come to light regarding both individuals that fall well below the standard we believe Commonwealth's attorneys must uphold to maintain public trust. Lee Searcy, LEX 18 News. Well, you can see more about this story, including the original report over on our website, lex18.com.